Hi, I'm Dr. Quip, and welcome to our web series on common pathogens. In this four-part series, we'll explain the difference between the different types of pathogens, the types of diseases they cause, and the best way to protect your facility, your employees, and your work from pesky microbes. If you want to watch all the videos in order, just click the pathogens playlist on our YouTube channel. Let's start with some definitions. The term pathogen most often describes any microorganism that causes a disease. These can range from simple illnesses like the common cold to more complex illnesses like tuberculosis. When one of these pathogens invades our body, we call that infection. Infection occurs when microbes like bacteria and viruses that exist all around us enter our bodies and begin to multiply. Disease occurs when the cells in your body are affected negatively by infection and signs and symptoms of an illness appear. While treating diseases is sometimes possible, it's always best to stop the spread of pathogens that cause them. Knowing which pathogens are in your facility and stopping their spread should be the top priority for your team. Fortunately, we're here to help. Over the next three videos, we'll teach you about the three main types of pathogens, how they can spread and hide throughout your facility, and how to control their numbers and stop them from putting your customers, your research animals, or your employees at risk. Remember, you can always find more information about pathogens and the chemical products we recommend to stop them by visiting quiplabs.com or calling 1-800-424-2436. When you're ready, click on the link to the next video on the screen, and if you like this video series and want to see more like it, you can let us know in the comments or by clicking the like or subscribe button. Thanks for watching, and remember, Quip Labs makes it safe simply and sensibly.